July 17th, everybody. It's a beautiful Thursday morning. Love, love, love Thursday because it's a day before our Fibonacci wave class. And here's the power of Fibonacci levels. This is picture perfect reminder how important decision point one is. This is where collapse continued, spelled out by the price days prior. And if you know Alpha Wave Trader Method, you had very powerful shorting opportunity yesterday after the trading room close. Choose a downside, reminding you know where decision point two is. This bullish rally started about three hours ago. We are not touching this rally because we're expecting powerful selling pressure at any moment. Very important levels to the upside. At any moment, selling pressure will step in. We ain't touching this bullish rally. It is overextended, monitoring for selling pressure. That would be incredibly critical what will play out on S&P in the next half an hour. It will set up the mood for the rest of today. We're going to find out in the next hour if price has enough pressure to continue to reversal zone. As so far, selling pressure still domineering on larger time frames. So, again, extreme caution, ain't touching S&P currently. Buyers are drastically weaker than sellers. Therefore, we are expecting selling pressure at any moment. Oil. Bullish rally picked up this steam yesterday, wrapping up only bearish correction at reversal zone. That was picture perfect reminder. This is where we were on oil. How dangerous it was buying oil and what was oil doing four hours in a row. Ending up only with bearish corrections, not reversal, giving very powerful bullish structure to the upside. And this is extremely important. This is very, very critical daily levels that correlate with reversal zone on our on hourly. We're potentially witnessing inception of the bearish collapse, identified by very powerful daily levels. Again, Reversal zone is a level where we do not acquire trend position, where we're monitoring four reversals. And that's where we are currently on oil. And that's where we are currently on S&P. S&P has already taken a bit of a pause, as we knew it would. And oil finding selling pressure. Again, monitoring for both on S&P and oil. Is this inception of the bearish trend or is this bearish correction? Extremely important hour across the board on oil and S&P that will set up direction for the rest of the day.